hi guys welcome to another video hmm. so guys don't mind this heart eh? i just want to take that small boy to the beach hmm. he's been worrying me hey hmm. i want to take my little boy to the beach that's why i'm all dressed up so i want to make this video before we leave uh, very soon he will be here so i want to be fast 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 so that we leave so guys, I want us to talk about something here. Yeah. I want you to know why I started my YouTube channel. So let's start this video now. Welcome back guys. So first of all, if you are new to this channel, my name is Abna Boatema. I'm a nurse slash upcoming youtuber yay we say youtube <laughs> so it's not easy you're battling with nursing and youtubing hmm. but you sink it you know now you sink it what i say you sink it you know now you sink it say a day so i've always wanted to be on tv when i was a little girl I wanted to be, everybody wanted to be doctor, lawyer, engineer, pharmacist, all those huge, huge professions. Hmm. But whenever my mom asked me, I'll either say I'll be a doctor or a journalist. I do baby cramp, I wanted to be a lawyer because I can argue for the whole world. If you can, if you can argue what I mean, you eh? <laughs> want to. I am so debative. Eh? If you bring a case to me, I, I I want you to know that this is wrong and this is right. So we we'll debate, we we'll argue on it. So I, when I was in SS, I did general art. I did general art. I, wa I was about to do, I wanted to do science, but I saw my nature. One of my teachers saw my nature. So in first year, she, he, my, my teacher told me, that teacher, I will not forget him. I don't, I don't want to mention his name. But Abra, go and, be, go and do general art. Too. Science is not your course. Go and do general art. So I did general art in school. I've always wanted to be on television. Always active. Hmm. I say, my summa dear cry out of home. I'm an active girl. Very active in, in activities. I was, I was born and bred in a Christian home. Yeah. My mom is a staunch Christian. She's a very good Christian. Guys, if I say Christianity, I give it to you. If they say Christianity has a human being. I'll give it to my mother. Yeah, that woman. She can pray. She can read the Bible. She can preach. So she brought us up in a godly way, in a Christian way. So we started Sunday school. Uh, we went from Sunday school to the youth ministry. Up and up and up. So I'll be you know that. Mm -hmm. And I attend. I'm a proud member of the Church of Pentecost. COP for life. So, in Pentecost, we have uh, something called Children's Day. Every year, they have Children's Day. You see, they'll be training us. We'll be going for rehearsals, training us on what to do on Children's Day. Some, some will be singing, some will be dancing, some will be doing uh, drama. You see, some will be reciting poems, reciting quotations, memory verses. And when I was inside the school, I think I did almost everything. I think I think I did almost everything. Hey, this earring where wants to give me problems. I think I did almost everything. Hmm. So I'll be I'll be part of the choreography. I'll be part of drama. I'll be part of <laughs> recitations. I don't know what I wasn't part of. Yes. So I was dancing. I was doing choreography in Sunday school. I was doing choreography, drama, reciting memory verses. Oh, it was nice. It was nice. Sunday school was bay. Sunday school was bay. When you go to youth ministry, then the vim went down. But when I was inside the school, I, I was, I was, I was involved in those activities because I loved doing them. I loved doing them. After secondary school, my dreams of being on TV shattered. Shattered, though. That one day is another story for another day. So, we went to church one day and someone called my mom and told my mom that your daughter, she sees, 
yeah, the, the person told my mom that he sees my daughter taking care of the sick and the elderly, the aged. Hmm. And I, I also have this passion for taking care of people. Uh, you see, when my mom is sick, eh, the way I take care of her, I, t I check her temperature, see if she's okay. I don't want any bad thing to happen to her. I'll be by her side, nursing her and at an early age. Not knowing I was meant to be a nurse. But inwardly, TV was my passion. But nursing, I think it's my profession. It's my calling. Nursing is my calling. But being on TV is my passion. Acting, doing drama, dancing. Oh my God. Guys, you should know by now. If you see, you can check through my videos, my channel. Eh? In my videos, I have dancing videos there. You see that? I love dancing. I love doing stuff. For enter I love entertainment. That's me. I'm an entertainer entertainer oh yeah <laughs> so when the person told my mom that he sees me taking care of people the sick the aged my mom didn't doubt he said it's true she told the person it's true because I'm, i always like taking care of people when i see people sick when i see that people are sick i don't like it i want the person to be well i want the person to be 100 percent healthy before i leave the person's side so we decided to go for nursing forms. Then I started my nursing school. And I became a nurse. But I've been watching YouTube. I've been watching YouTube for the more than for more than four years. I've been watching YouTube. I've been on YouTube for more than four years. Watching recipes, watching movies, watching people's life, how people do vlogs educative videos informative videos on youtube and i was wondering i said ah what they are doing i can't do that with my phone because me i'm a food girl when i go to church the number of selfies and the number of snapchat i do eh? i can do this here the earring has fallen again let's leave this earring so i can do this i know i can do it so i started making little little videos in my room i'll take my phone go on video a camera record one or two a minute video about hi hope you're doing well hello my name is then i'll check and see if i look presentable on camera <laughs> don't judge me guys so my dream of becoming a youtuber has finally been fulfilled when i go to work I go and take care of my clients at work, my patients at work. I feel fulfilled that I have helped someone in his or her recovery. When I come back home, I take my phone or my camera. Then I start shooting myself. I become so happy. See, ah, I'm also on YouTube. I also have my own channel. I can educate people. I can share my life experiences on YouTube. I can, I can do a lot of stuff on my channel, educative stuff, ed entertaining stuff on my channel without me feeling bad that I haven't achieved all that I wanted to achieve in this world. Guys, you look, you only live once. If you have a passion, please fulfill that passion. If you know that you, you want to do something badly, and there are stumbling blocks stumbling blocks don't look at those stumbling blocks just achieve it it's achievable everything is achievable on this earth provided you are determined this youtuber is determination oh hmm. if you see the views if you look at your views eh, you won't continue you won't pursue your career or your your, your passion just dog everything and just focus be focused guys be focused so that's what i want to tell you guys let's be te determined in everything you want to do don't let anybody ruin your 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 happiness no provided your channel is about good stuff you know educating entertaining don't bring bad stuff to the public no 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 
so guys this is my little experience i don't want this video to be too long you see eh, you don't need to have all the gadgets or the equipment to be shooting videos on youtube no you can use your phone you can chuck your phone somewhere and do your youtube you see eh, my i recently got a tripod my michael destroyed it but i'm shooting this video do you know how i'm shooting this video my camera is on it's chopped somewhere <laughs> but i'm shooting the video because i'm determined so let's be determined and full cost so thank you for listening to me and i hope you enjoyed this small just a chat so we are about to leave now and we are about to leave now uh, i don't know if i'll vlog i think i'll vlog I experienced at the beach and placed it on this channel for you to enjoy nothing much just my little boy and i having fun we are bored you know we are bored after work you can't be sitting at home uh, waiting for this pandemic to be over before you go our lockdown has been lifted so i used this opportunity to take him to a quiet beach just a quiet this is bojo beach it's not those Kole Kole Beach is no. This is a Bujo Beach. Quiet place. It's when when you go there, you see. When I get there, you see. So sit, relax, and enjoy that video. Don't forget to subscribe. Please subscribe and turn on your notification. Because you don't want to miss that video. You don't want to miss that video. So thank you for watching once again. Remain blessed. And please stay safe. I love you. But God loves you more. Bye.